Here are the 10 most dangerous African animals. Ignore number two, it's irrelevant. Number 10. Slithering in at number 10 is the puff adder. The puff adder is a venomous viper that makes the black mamba look like the black mama's boy. The average size for the serpent is about 40 inches, but they can grow up to 75 if they're good at hunting. By the way, do you know why snakes are measured in inches? Because they have no feet. The puff adder is commonly found all over Africa in every region except for the rainforest and the savanna. You don't want to hiss them off because their venom is cytotoxic in nature, which means that it's toxic to living cells. Because of its ubiquity in Africa, its good camouflage, and its potent venom, the puff adder is responsible for more snake bite fatalities than any other snake on the continent. So if you see one, Stay back. Number nine. Coming in at number nine is an unapologetically prodigious killing machine and my biggest fear. Carcharodon carcharius, also known as the great white shark, is the BSD of the sea. These jerks are unequivocally apex predators, which means that they are at the top of the food chain and really have nothing to worry about except the occasional orca. They are regarded as the most dangerous animal swimming in the coastal waters of Africa. These soulless eating machines are responsible for the majority of the unprovoked and fatal shark attacks on humans. In an effort to stymie the shark attacks, South Africa has introduced a shark spotting program in the beaches in and around Cape Town. It is the only program of its kind in the world. Shark spotters actively monitor the seas around popular beaches and use a warning flag system to communicate sightings to swimmers. All right, enough of that. I'm finished with talking about sharks. Can you stop with the puns? If I said yes, I'd be lying. Before we move on, be sure to subscribe. Hit the bell button to get notified of new videos, and we always appreciate a big thumbs up. Number eight. In many places around the world, dogs are considered man's best friend. But in Africa, they're a little more like frenemies. Africa has a different sort of canine known as African wild dogs. As the name implies, these are not the domesticated rovers that you keep in your backyard and follow around with a plastic bag. These are killing machines. They have a crazy strong bite and massive premolars that are designed to crunch through bones. African wild dogs are so proficient at hunting that when they begin to chase down an animal, they have an 80% chance of making the kill. To put that in perspective, when lions hunt, their success rate is 20%. This provides conclusive evidence to the notion that dogs rule and cats drool. Sometimes called the devil's dog, they are highly socialized and live in strict hierarchical packs. As vicious as they are, they do have some altruistic habits. If a pack of wild dogs comes across an orphan, they will adopt it and someday it could become alpha. Also, the standard transition between the position of alpha is non-violent and the former alpha gets to stay in the pack. They're doing their best to change the perception that this is a dog-eat-dog -dog world. Number seven. Anyone who watched James and the Giant Peach as a kid remembers that that rhino was absolutely terrifying. Well, the rhinos of Africa are just as scary and way more real. They can weigh over 6,000 pounds, which is heavier than an industrial forklift. So remember, never bring a forklift to a rhino fight. They have thick protective skin like armor and large horns which are just perfect for impaling. You really can't toot their horn enough. Although the rhinoceros is the second largest animal in Africa after the elephant, it's crazy fast. It can sprint up to speeds of 35 miles per hour. 
To give you a frame of reference, in the 100 meter dash, Usain Bolt, one of the fastest humans ever, clocked in at 28 miles an hour. Rhinos are very territorial and readily charge any perceived threat. Their speed plus weight makes a powerful combination and they've been known to topple over SUVs. So if you find yourself staring down the barrel of a charging rhino, you might as well just call it a life. Game over, man. Game over. Number six. The next pernicious beast on our list is pretty horrific. It may rattle the faint of heart and unsettle the squeamish. Put the kids in the next room because number six is the mosquito. The mosquito is by far the most pervasive and deadly killer in Africa. Is deadly killer redundant? You bet it is. This odious insect flies from animal to animal, piercing their skin and sucking their blood like a Capri Sun, son! Their bites aren't just itchy and annoying, they're also a very efficient way to spread disease. Different genuses of mosquito carry different diseases, including potentially fatal illnesses like Zika virus, yellow fever, dengue fever, Nile virus, and malaria. In 2016 alone, there were over 400,000 malaria-related deaths in Africa. Only the female mosquitoes bite, so in June of 2018, Bill Gates, in a bold move to abate malaria, decided to donate $4 million to a project to create genetically modified male mosquitoes that would kill the blood-sucking women. The project is expected to be ready for trials by the end of 2020. Let's hope it's a success and that the mosquitoes will buzz off forever. Number five. Are you feeling hungry hungry? Well, so is number five on our list, the hippo. Did you think I'd do an entire dangerous African animal video and not mention the hippopotamus? That would make me a real hypocrite. Despite being an herbivore and having a super silly name, when it comes to humans, the hippopotamus is considered to be the most deadly mammal in Africa. They are extremely territorial and are responsible for eliminating more people than any other land species. Hippos are known for being eminently aggressive, so it's best to avoid them at all costs. Clocking in at 3,000 pounds with sharp teeth and surprising agility on land and water, these real-life monsters are built for destruction. Number four. Coming in at number four is a mammal at the tippy top of the food chain. A creature that decimates all in its path. Humans! That's an M. Night Shyamalan level twist for you. Of all animals on the list, apart from the mosquito, man is by far the most dangerous. An average of 50 people lose their lives at the hands of others each day in South Africa. Tribal conflicts, war, genocide, all add to the toll. We are just the worst. Humane? More like Hugh Lame. Number three. Number three on our list is an indigenous North African predator and is responsible for hundreds of human deaths each year. The Nile Crocodile. Crocodiles have been around on Earth for 240 million years and their average lifespan is about 55. The Nile Crocodile can grow to be 14 feet long and is known for its aggressive nature and typically strikes at children due to their smaller size. One half of their attacks are fatal. Despite their prevalence across the continent, people still have trouble telling alligators and crocodiles apart. But it's really not that difficult. One will see you later, and the other will see you in a while. Number two. Pack your trunk and get out of Dodge because number two is the elephant. Due to their size, the elephant is the most revered animal in Africa. Typically, they're gentle giants, but the older bull elephants and the younger males can be cantankerous, which is bad news bears because they can trample you like bubble wrap. The best practice is to avoid upsetting an elephant at all costs because he'll never forget. Number one. 
Coming in at our number one spot, the most formidable and deadly predator in the animal kingdom, the king of mean. Hide your kids, hide your wife, cause we got hyenas up in here. A hyena by itself is deadly, but these ferocious feeders always hunt in packs. Highly intelligent, socially coordinated, and with a bite capable of crushing bone. These indomitable carnivores are known to steal fresh kills from lions, cheetahs, and leopards. Scientists have run problem solving and social cooperation tests on hyenas, and they performed at a higher level than chimpanzees. These guys are wicked smart. And every year, there are reports of hyena attacks on humans up and down Africa. 95% of what hyenas eat comes from hunting, and a pack of hyenas can devour an entire zebra in less than 30 minutes. I'm talking bones and all, everything gone. Lions and hyenas frequently compete over the same territory, and the hyena's favorite move against their adversary is to eliminate their burgeoning cubs. Sorry, Simba, that's just the circle of life. If you want to get down and get your hands dirty, then save some money to the side for your investment. Pick some investments yourself and use an online trading platform. Investing may be a risk, but it can be a calculated one that could result in giving you some extra paydays. If you want to be able to stack cash like you see in this picture, you need to get off the couch and start doing something today. Board Badger!